A local favorite was at risk of being up for sale when an unlikely hero stepped in to save it. Thirteener Side's Riley Mack gives us that story. Riley. Elena, she may not be family, but Caitlin Franklin, the new co-owner of the Dairy Queen on Walker Avenue, sure runs the shop like a family business. In a city always on the move, time has stood still at the Dairy Queen on Walker Avenue. We've always run it the same way. The same owners. Long time. For over 65 years. Yes. Caitlin Franklin has been here for a while. Yep. It all started thanks to her parents. They were having me go up to the window, fill out the application. Have you looked at my application yet? And I bugged them enough that they hired me. <laughs> A decision that would change her life. I've worked here for 14 years. 14 years of their beloved dilly bars. We make them homemade. Everything's dipped from scratch and a lot of love goes into it. I think it tastes better. A lot of people think it tastes better. This year started a little differently than the 13 before. Caitlin learned the owners were looking to pack up the sprinkles and sell. I grew up with them. They're like family to me. What she loved most about her job. The staff and the people, really. Would be changing. New ownership, someone maybe the community didn't know as well. Her and Jessie Barwin, the owner's daughter. Very close friend. She's actually in my wedding this year. Scooped up a plan. We kind of put our heads together and decided that we could do this together. Friends turned co-owners. Just kick butt running the Dairy Queen. In a place where time stands still, change is coming. The support was outstanding. It was overwhelming. It like brought tears to my eyes. This family owned business will be saved. We want it to go generations to generations by chosen family. It's been my dream. I've always loved working at Dairy Queen since the moment I started. The Dairy Queen is open from 1 to 9 every day this summer. This Thursday is Miracle Treat Day where every blizzard you buy goes towards Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. Elena.